It's a video of our 2009 59 plate Mercedes Sprinter luxury minibus. Walk you around the vehicle, show you the condition outside and in, and some of the features. So, starting on the outside. Nice bright silver paintwork. As mentioned in the advert, there are a few bits on the bodywork that will just benefit from a bit of tidying. So, front bumper does have some chips and marks around it. Front fog lamp glass is just caught a stone there. Got some chips on the front grille here as well. To be expected, I suppose, at 126,000 miles. For me, that just went a bit tidying up, really. See down the sides here. It's had the extra body kit fitted, so join marks aren't the best on it. See it on there. To make it perfect, really want it all smoothing out. Nice big panoramic star windows. Show you more of those when we get inside. Tires are good. Hopefully you can see there. Really good tread on the tires. So just move around to the rear here. You can see it's got a tow bar on it. And a high level reversing camera gives you a straight down picture of what's going on behind you. A little mark here in the tailgate, otherwise tailgate pretty good. Just show you the back. Now this is something that attaches in place of the courier seat in the front if you want a handrail in there instead. You can see it's a large carpeted area with light, perfect for storage of any items that you might need to put in there. So now to the driver's side. Again, same thing, the kit. Just deal with smoothing out, refitting properly. It's due to these little bits on the outside that we've, we've priced it how we have. Obviously appreciate somebody might want to put a bit of work into it. Put this join down here. It's coming away a bit. I'll just take a few steps back so you can see, but it has the high level air conditioning unit. I'll just show you inside how that operates. So we're moving now. Entry steps into the vehicle. You can hopefully make out the camera here. This is all like a suede type fabric, which is really nice. Black ashwood trims on there. This is the main entertainment control system. So you've got your reverse camera comes on here, the satellite navigation, DAB radio and you can also play DVDs through this that go to the screens up in the roof which I'll, I'll show you those in just a second. Get it in here. But the main console here working all the lights in the vehicle so all the strip lighting etc which again I'll, I'll show you shortly. And here is the microphone system. We have got a, a microphone to go in that so you can talk to people who are sat in the vehicle. So moving round, see it's uh, carpet over the hard floor, there it's all suede trim around the windows, matching up with the curtains. In the roof you've got these aircraft style vents to blow air conditioning all the way along. Got the roof vent there, that doesn't actually open, that's just a, more of a skylight than anything. 
Let me give a bit of a close up on the seats. You can see they're all in excellent order. You've got the skirts at the bottom of them as well. So you don't see the legs. And they're all fitted on a tracking system. Uh, this here is the fridge in the vehicle. So it's a decent sized fridge there. Moving around to the back seats, we've got here two tables and then some seats facing each other. As we move down, see the hands there for getting out of the vehicle safely. Yeah, it's a very, very nice environment in here actually. I'll just start the vehicle up and show you that the air conditioning system operates fine there and some of the strip lighting. So, bear with me a second. I'll also show you the dash. So as you can hopefully make out, 126,000 miles. There's no lights on on the dash. Up here is the controller for the air conditioning. So with the press of this button, we can set that running. And set the temperature down. You can hear that in the background. That's blowing air out of all those individual vents into the rear. It gets it really nice and cool. We have checked this, it is very cold. So absolutely perfect. Now here, we have many different operations. Just turn this on. As you can see, you've got navigation, DVD, DAB, Bluetooth, etc. And that, if you put a DVD in there, will play to the screen that we have up in the roof here. Now there is an additional screen at the rear, but the gentleman who part exchanged this in has advised us that this screen, whilst it has power to it, hasn't been working off the DVD player. So if you want that to be playing off there, you might have to investigate that a little. Show you good storage up here. And the condition and finish inside, I have to say, is superb. We were informed that the gentleman spent circa £20,000 doing the whole interior and exterior conversion, which looking at the, the quality of the job, I can believe that. So you can see it's all wonderfully finished. Really just wants a bit of tidying on the outside and you, you've got one, one heck of a vehicle. Now I'll just show you some of these lighting features here. So if I flick on this one here, it gives you strip lights there and we can also go some blue neon colour in the LEDs as well. Finish it off nicely. Now, if there's anything else you need to know about this vehicle, please pick up the phone and give me a call. I'd be happy to talk to you. Um, or I can, I can go and take pictures of any specific bits if they're not already covered in this video. Thanks for looking.